Today's workout is a full body TRX workout. A TRX is a strap suspension system like this one behind me. The thing that I like about a TRX workout is you can get a really good full body workout using just these straps using a very small area of space. And you can make things easier by adding assistance or you can make them harder by using the stability aspect of the TRX, which we're gonna go into a little bit more in the video. I'm just going to be demonstrating, so as always, if you wanna follow along, just push that pause button and complete two or three sets of each exercise. I would suggest doing 10 to 12 reps in each exercise. As always, if you're new here, please consider liking, subscribing, and hitting that notification bell. All right, guys, let's do it. I'ma give it to you G straight And I'm out beat slay I'm not a human being Ballin' like Kareem Sippin' on codeine I lean with it Rock with it Got coke dreams Boom, back Boom in the trap When trap meets house You get a trap house Got two stacks Throw it at a strip dancer Big booty hoe Said she from Atlanta Taking hold of the TRX with your hands and walking your feet forward so that you've got um, some room to pull your body up. If you want to make it harder, you're going to step your feet closer to the attachment. If you want to make it easier, you're going to step away. One thing that's important in both the high row and the low row is that your shoulders are staying down away from your ears. And I guess Love to watch the a single leg curtsy lunge, making sure your knee is driving out, it's staying right over your ankle and not collapsing inwards. To make this easier, you can touch your foot down, step it down, and put some weight in it, that foot that's going behind you, instead of keeping it kind of hovering or just tapping. See your eyes in every stranger I play the way that we were till I'm high No it's not right tricep extension here. Again, the harder you want to make it, the closer you're going to stand to the TRX. Keeping your core engaged so you're not feeling this in your low back at all. Keeping your body just straight like a board. Next 
next one, looping your foot through the stirrup part of the TRX and transitioning your weight backwards into a lunge. This is a bohemian lunge variation with some added stability and you can kind of balance it out by putting a little bit of weight in that back foot or if you want to have it be more of a glute and a quad workout, you can transfer your weight more into that front leg. The main thing is that the weight stays in your heel rather than in the toe. In your knee, you want to stay right over your foot, your ankle to your toe, but not past your toe. Now a side lunge variation, again, keeping your knee pointed straight forward in the same direction as your toes rather than letting it collapse in. This is a good adductor workout for that leg that's extended, some quads and glutes on that single leg. You want most of the weight in the leg that's on the ground. bridge, lifting your hips, extending your knees, and setting your hips back down. This one is a burner. It helps to keep your toes flexed to keep them in those stirrups. Pushing up evenly with both legs or you're going to get off balance. Last one, doing a push-up and tuck variation. Core nice and tight here. Even in the push-up, you're not letting that low back dip, but you're keeping it nice and straight, rounding your pelvis under so that we're never putting the pressure in our low back. And a variation of this would be bringing your knees down when you do the push-up. Here's the variation, pushing up and then lifting up for that tuck. All right guys, that's a wrap. Thank you for joining me for this TRX workout. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. As always, you can leave requests for future videos and any questions you have down in the comment section, leave a question about rehab, leave a question about form, and I will answer you guys as soon as I can. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next one.